another tip about where's a good place to find passengers. Well, you know, some bigger bigger cities, they have restrictions on, uh, you know, in different rules about airports and such. Uh, Lynchburg doesn't have any rules at all. You just go pull up there and whatever, whoever's the closest driver gets it. So, um, so that's different, like in Lynchburg or bigger cities, they might have different rules. But train stations and bus stations, um, generally they just follow the normal rules of any city you drive in. There's no like special rules for them. I mean, I might be wrong about that in some particular cases, but yeah, um, you can go in by the way and get the bus schedule and get the train schedule and then just be over there, you know, just be over there when, when they're going to be unloading people. It's really easy. It's a great way of uh, people traveling, uh, people that are, um, coming in on a plane, a train or a bus generally are going to need a longer ride than the average person the normal normal person goes uh they need travel to and from places that are that are close to where they live um or they're just going down the road from one business to another that kind of thing uh, but they try to stay everything as close as possible so that they don't have to pay as much for their ride which is you know what i do so uh but the thing is with people traveling they can't, they can't decide which, you know, bus station or train station or airport that uh, they want to choose around the corner from their house because there's like 500 of them. There's just one, you know, two, three in any big city area, you know. So, um, so those are the kinds of places that are really good to pick people up because your rides are going to be longer in general. So you, you can sometimes you could pick up rides that are like an hour long those type of places down the highway and that's great you know think about an hour long you know let's say you go 40 miles uh you know you're you're gonna be racking up the money a lot faster so anyways those are great places to hang out just thought i'd throw that one out to you so as usual shalom uber dan here with three quick tips first get your first uber ride free by downloading the uber app and entering this promo code for 15 dollars off Two, receive a $100 bonus for completing your first 30 rides when you register as an Uber driver through the link below. After that, just download the Uber driver app and get rolling. And C, I really genuinely want to help you out with this Uber stuff, so please subscribe, share, and leave me some feedback. Seriously, ask questions and tell me what you really want to see. As always, thank you and appreciate it. Hey, 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 hey